Hi, this is step six of the old age makeup and this has to do with the lips. I've already put um, the foundation on, so that's our good starting point. There's, uh, there are three different steps to this one. The first one, we're going to make our lips look kind of um, cracked. So the way that we do this is we take our um, shadow color, we're going to just put it on our finger and we're going to just pat a little bit on this, on our lips. We don't want to look like we have, you know, like horribly brown lips, but we want to put a little color on it because the next step of this, we're going to take our latex sponge and our, sh and our highlight, and what I'm going to do is I am going to purse my lips. Now, I'm not going to pucker them. I'm going to purse them. But when you pucker your lips, you go out like this. When you purse your lips, you want to make them as, as squished together as possible. You're going to squish up your lips. As much as you can, and you're going to pat it with your highlight. And you're going to blend all the rest of it. But what that does is it gives a really good cracked look to our lips. Is that crazy? <laughs> the second step that we're going to do is we're going to take some of these cracks. I'm going to blend away all the rest of this. We're going to take some of these cracks and we're going to extend them. We're going to make uh, uh, some wrinkles. You guys know how to make wrinkles. We're going to extend them. And so I'm going to look at some of my deeper, my deeper ones. And I'm going to extend them. I'm going to see which ones I'm going to get anyway. That's happy. I'm going to get that one. This one's going to get lower. So I, I start them, if you notice, I start them in my lip. And I go out onto my skin. Ooh, that one's gonna be good. Hmm. I have two lower ones right here. And I might have one over here. Now, you don't wanna do too many of them because you don't want it to look like a railroad track. Um, you want it to look like wrinkles, which we've talked about before. And then I'm gonna, of course, do highlight because wrinkles aren't wrinkles without highlight and shadow. So if I want to, rem I don't need to remind you, huh? That highlight goes inside, inside, so towards my nose, towards my nose, on this side they're going to go in the other direction. Oh, that one's too, that one got too much on it, so I'm going to add a little bit more. Okay, the last step. So we did that cool cracked effect, and then we did elongated some of those. The last step is the corner wrinkles, uh, and we're going to just make some wrinkles on these, the corner wrinkles. And then, of course, we're going to put that highlight underneath those and blend if necessary. Oh, like that one right there needs to be blended because it's too white right there. Uh, remember, they're going to get longer, right? The older you get. So you can elongate them a little bit. Okay, and there we have, okay, this here, we have our longer wrinkles here, and then our corner wrinkles, which are getting longer and longer every year I do this. That's depressing. So <laughs> this is step six, lips.